The Tale of the Angry Cat Benjamin, catch! <gasps> Phew! Quietly, in the sack! Uh, uh, oh, oh no! Without those sprouts. Hey, let's hide under here until the coast is clear. Now we've been here a long time. Too long. Look at all this snow. One of these crates must be the sprouts. But which one? They all look the same. Hmm. Rabbits. <gasps> sprout stealing rabbits. Mr. McGregor, hurry, Peter. Which one is it? Stop. Uh, I think. Uh, these are the sprouts. One, two, three. <laughs> It'll be rubber and sprouts for you for dinner. Help me! <laughs> Roberts! Sprouts are heavier than they look. Come back here! Perfect. Much better than one of Peter's snow rabbits. Did I hear someone call my name? Peter! <laughs> Ta-da! What? It's just a load of snow. Ah, that's what you think. It's a stash of the most juicy, delicious, amazing... Kitty cat! Wow! Into the burrow, quick! Cotton tail. Uh, Kitty's not nice. Kitty's angry. We'll never get those sprouts now. N never mind the sprouts. What are we going to do about the cats? <gasps> what? I was going to give it back. I promise. Benjamin, that toy belongs to Mr. McGregor's cat. Peter? What's this about a cat in the burrow? Cat? There's no cat in the burrow. <gasps> Just a cat uh, toy. Huh? toy. We uh, found it and uh, brought it home by accident. The toy, uh, not, not the cat. Definitely not the cat. <laughs> uh uh. Well, you know what to do with things that don't belong to you, don't you? Uh, 
uh, yes, Mum, we'll take this toy right back where we found it. But, Mother, we, we saw, saw a cat. cat just outside. Mum! Peter, we have to get the cat back to Mr McGregor's garden too. No way are we going out there. That cat is dangerous. Hmm, Peter. There's one thing the cat wants more than us. While we keep the cat busy chasing this, we'll run into the garden and get the sprouts. Easy. Oh, uh -huh, no. No way. Come on, Benjamin. A good rabbit never gives up. We can do this. We can? Oh, uh, of course we can. Benjamin, on the count of three, throw the toy to the cat. One, two, three. Yeah. Plan. I have a plan. We go home? No, not before we get the cat back to the garden. And don't forget, we have to get the sprouts. I know. We need some string, which luckily I carry with me, just in case. And we'll need the cat toy, Cottontail. Uh, what is she doing? No idea. Ready, boys? Ready. OK, Cat, back to the garden you go! that much. Blech. Come on, Peter, let's go home. No way. I'm not leaving without those sprouts. They're way too good to leave behind. This time we'll get into the garden without the cat seeing us. I know. We'll tie one of us to the branch, pull it back, then whoosh, catapult into the garden, grab the sprouts, come back, and we all head home. Um, which one of us were you thinking of catapulting into the garden? Me catapult! No way, Cottontail. It's too dangerous. I should do it. <laughs> Robot! He's seen us! We'd better make this fast. Let's hop to it! We just need to get that sack of sprouts onto the cart and out of the gate. You brought the cart, right? Uh, sort of. What? Uh, we uh, left it on the other side of the gate. Uh, then we'll just have to roll the sack. Come on. <coughs> Hurry. <laughs> Thought you'd come back, did you? <laughs> I've got you at last. When I say jump, jump onto the sack. Uh, you won't escape me now. <coughs> Whoa! Whoa! See you on the other side! Back here. I hope. 
Well, I've got one of you. <gasps> hey, one of Dad's secret tunnels. Sorry, Mr. McGregor, but there'll be no rabbit pie on the menu tonight. <laughs> Come back here. It was a huge cat. This big. Really, you two? I didn't see a cat in the burrow. Just a cat toy, and your brother is returning it. <laughs> Anybody hungry? Brussels sprouts? Oh, pizza! <laughs> so, how did you get them? Kitty cat! Peter Rabbit! Looks like we've got some explaining to do. Sprout! <laughs> <laughs> Tale of Mr. Todd's Trap. <laughs> okay, ready, Benjamin? Ready, Lily? Ready! One, two, three! <laughs> Doesn't look much like a snow rabbit to me. Just needs a few finishing touches. so big and round, we could call him Roly-Poly. Hello, Roly-Poly. Are you hungry? <laughs> oh, <laughs> tummy alarm. Anyone else hungry? <laughs> <laughs> That's a yes. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> OK, that settles it. Lunch time. Let's hop to it. The trouble is, this time of year, we only ever get to eat cabbage. Cabbage soup. Cabbage casserole. Cabbage... <gasps> Radishes? Are you seeing what I'm seeing? If you're seeing a pile of the most sweet-smelling, mouth-watering tasty radishes in the whole wide world, then yes, I am. Let's eat! Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh. Lily? This is wrong. Very wrong. Radishes don't just appear in the middle of the woods. And definitely not in winter. Something smells fishy. Mmm. Smells pretty radishy to me. Hey! <gasps> Think about it. Who would leave something like this out here? It has to be a trap. Tra trap Or maybe it's not a trap. Shame to waste all this yummy food. Um. He could be right, Lily. It's better to be safe than sorry. Uh, maybe Lily's right. We'd better leave them. Tell that to my tummy. Now <laughs> 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 oh, that's the tastiest lunch I never had. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Peter, <laughs> if something seems too good to be true, it probably is. <laughs> I know, I know. You've told me a hundred times. Those radishes look so yummy. Mm. Oh, shush! I'm not talking to you anymore. Must stop thinking about radishes. Must stop thinking about radishes. Must stop thinking about radish. Here's the radish. Huh? Ah! What are you doing here? Um, just out for a little walk. Wait a second, what are you doing here? I couldn't stop thinking about those radishes. Me neither. Come on. <laughs> what, what was that? Lily! It was a trap. I knew it! Peter! It must be Mr. Todd's trap. He's got to be on his way. We'd better do something fast. I hear the dinner bell. Somebody must have fallen into my trap. I wonder what I've caught today. A duck? A squirrel? 
or a rabbit. <laughs> If something looks uh, too good to be true, it probably uh, is. Uh, uh. <sighs> <sighs> and didn't you say it was a trap? Okay, okay. I just couldn't resist the most mouth-watering, tastiest radishes ever. Help me down. Benjamin, hop up. Uh, 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 just a little closer. Uh, uh. Benjamin! Oh. Don't worry, Lily. We'll save you. Ah, the old figure of eight rolling hitch double overhand two and a half loop. Uh, say that all again, but really slowly. It's a type of knot. Crumbs, keys, comb. Just in case, Bucket, just in case. I can use the comb to unknot the knot. All I need is a little time. You want time? You got it. Come on, Benjamin. We're going to slow down that fox. Just wait here, Lynn. Where else would I go? I just knew one of those fluffy fools would walk right into my trap. With a little luck, I'll be having roast rabbit this evening. <laughs> Start tunneling. Stand back. That should trip him up. Steam and simmer, bake and stew, grilled or fried barbecue. Ah! <laughs> that stopped him in his tracks. Oh, how I hate rabbits, leaving holes all over the place. Uh, onwards and upwards. We have to try again. Lily's depending on us. Got to unknot this. Uh, no! Come on, Lily Bobtail. You've got yourself into this mess. Now think your way out. Shake it! <laughs> 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 If I didn't know any better, I'd say someone was trying to stop me from getting to my trap. Achoo! Oh. Oh. Oopsie. We've got to buy Lily more time to untie that knot. We have to stop Mr Todd. Off you go, no time to lose, you best be on your way. You can't afford to fail today Proceed with care, think fast and stay aware And you'll succeed at what you're trying to do So off you go, and you should know The golden reach is waiting there for you Closer, closer, closer Not close enough. Lily, we can't stall Mr. Todd anymore. Get out of here. There's no sense in all of us getting caught. No way. A good rabbit never gives up. Uh, I'm just going to hide behind you for a second. I wish we never have found these radishes. Oh, I wish it had never snowed and we never built that snow rabbit and we... Snow rabbits, Benjamin. That's it. Of course that's it. Wait, what's it? Come on, we have to go. What? But we can't leave Lily here. <sighs> Peter! Oh, please or not. Please. Lily Bobtail, you're the last rabbit I expected to trap. You're usually so cautious. Never mind. So glad you could hang around for lunch. All that falling down holes and ducking icicles has made me rather ravenous. 
rabbit with a side dish of radish? What do you think? I don't think so. You're wasting your time. Nobody can untie one of my special figure eight rolling hitch double overhand two and a half loop knots. Hey, Mr. Ford, up here! You're too late to save your little friend, Peter Rabbit. You're right, she is little. Hardly going to make much of a meal, is she? Uh, uh, yeah, I'm just a snack compared to our friend Rolly over there. Hey, Lucky Rolly Poly wasn't caught in your trap. Look at the size of him. He'd make a fine breakfast, lunch and dinner. With enough left over for sandwiches. Hmm, and he doesn't look like he could run away very fast. It's dinner time, Rolly Poly. <laughs> gotcha! Over, round, and got it! Uh, we, we did it! We did it! Woo! Yeah! yeah! I'm free! You're free! <laughs> Phew, that was close. Sorry we took so long. What? I'm so hungry. All right, all right. Quiet down. We're going home. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, rats! Out foxed by rabbits! I should have stayed in bed. We won't be fooled by a pile of radishes again. <laughs> huh? Radishes? radishes? Uh, um, I'm not that hungry. <laughs> <laughs>